escape this damnation that waits people outside of an old-fashioned Holy Ghost sent repentance. Amen. I have nothing against my brethren, and I'm speaking of myself, but we are evangelists. Billy Graham, a great evangelist. Old Roberts, a great evangelist. Them are great men. We appreciate them, but we don't need evangelists. What is it? Organizing politics. Amen. Getting the Methodists and Baptists and all the Pentecostal groups together to cooperate and show how big we can be and how many we can draw out. Amen. We don't need that. Oh, we need a waiting on God till the Holy Ghost comes with power. Amen. We need salvation. Amen. Not evangelists. We need salvation. Amen. We can take this mountain. Amen. Who is that mountain before Zerbellum? It'll be like a plain, God said. Remain in the land. That's right. What we need today is a, not a revival, a breaking out of salvation, like in the days of the Welsh revival, when the people in the shops fell under conviction, crying, the bootleg joints and pleasure places closed up and went to weeping and praying. That's what we need today. Not get 150,000 like did the other day. Some of them saying, Hail Mary, and the other and saying something else. A little prayer and go out and get a sociable drink and go back. That's not a day of prayer. No. We need a day of weeping and mourning and waiting until God sends the Holy Ghost. His witness. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Not an empty shell. Not an empty denomination. But deity. Tabernacle in man. Jesus said in Mark 16 that the Holy Ghost, when he come, he had testify in every succeeding generation to the end. Amen. He said, these signs go ye into all the world and preach the gospel to every creature. These signs shall follow them that believe. Amen. In my name they shall cast out devils. How long is this witness going to be? To the end of the world. Amen. How long? Every generation. In my name they shall cast out devils, they shall speak with new tongues. If they take it up serpents or drink deadly things, wouldn't harm them. If they lay hands on the sick, they shall recover. Jesus said that the Holy Spirit that he would send would be a witness to the end of the age. Amen. Every generation afterward. Now, being that he said that, we are his witnesses. Amen. 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 Close and listen close. Put on your understanding now. Listen as I close. We are his witnesses who have received of his spirit. His word testifies in the last days that there will come a falling away. And there will come up a cold, formal, powerless church age. That's what we're living in. A church that had no power having a form of godliness, but denying the power thereof. Amen. From such turn away. He give the sign of there be times when a man would sit in the temple of God, showing himself he was God. he come ruling the nations. How perfect did all these things. How God's word has been perfect. How King...